pills, grass-fed beef. And really what we're doing is regenerating the land by properly managing cattle and land together. So we want to regenerate soil and reestablish grasslands. So our conventional agriculture, so this soil came from my farm. I went out to our field that we grazed for about seven years now and took a shovel into the grassland and this is what I got. And I put it in a plastic bag to come here and I thought maybe there's something in there. When I tore this apart, several worms fell out and there's a caterpillar right there. Uh. And it starts to represent oh, yeah. what is in our soil when you're regenerating it. We can capture water, we can sequester carbon out of the environment, we can grow diverse grasslands and not release carbon, but we need to manage it in a way that regenerates. Now, I went 20 feet away and I put the shovel in the ground in a conventional cornfield, same soil, meaning the same type of soil. But this is what I got. So, no structure, no biodiversity, no plants, no worms, nothing like that happening in this soil. This is what we've been doing to our soil for 70 years in our conventional monoculture agriculture. This is what we want to do with our soil for our food system. Because right now, we're doing this to our soil, and we're putting, for example, the output in our gas tanks in ethanol. Mm. So all the nutrition of our soil, we're burning up in our gas tanks. This, we want to grow food for future generations that will keep regenerating itself. It's what nature designed. Animals on the land, grazing grasslands, no tilling, no chemicals, no petrochemicals, no pesticides, and building soil. So thank you. Thank you.